This video is brought to you by Altium. In today's episode, you will learn how to make an IoT based voice controlled home automation system using IFTTT, Google Assistant Voice, and the Adafruit IO. This advanced level home automation system is based on the ESP32 Wi-Fi Plus Bluetooth module. I will explain each and every detail including how to create a very simple dashboard in Adafruit I.O., how to create different applets for voice commands in IFTTT using Google Assistant, and how to link all these different IoT platforms to make a completely functional home automation system or smart home system. Since this project is based on the IoT Internet of Things, so this home automation system can be controlled from anywhere in the world. For the demonstration purposes, I have used an electronic door lock and a 110 or 220 volt AC light bulb. If you want, you can use some other types of loads and of course you can increase or decrease the number of loads. It's totally up to you. Anyways, before I'm going to explain the circuit diagram, IFTTT Google Assistant settings and programming. First, let's watch this home automation system in action. My 12 volt DC electronic door lock and the 220 volt AC light bulb are connected with the relays. I have already powered up my ESP32 board and it's connected with the Wi Fi. When everything is powered up, never touch the relays contacts as 220 volt AC can be really dangerous. So when everything is ready, simply go ahead and open the Google Assistant and start controlling your electrical devices turn on the using light. voice commands. The light is turn, on. turn off the light. Turn off the light. Light is turn off. Open the door. Close the door. Door is closed. Open the door. Door is opened. Close the door. Door is closed. Turn on the light. The light is turned on. Turn off the light. Light is turn off. The Adafruit I.O. is unbelievably fast. I don't see any delay. And I think the Adafruit I.O. can be a perfect choice for the real-time sensor monitoring or the long distance. Turn on the light. The light is turned on. Open the door. I have been testing this home automation system for a while and I didn't see Close any fast door. triggering and long delays. The IFTTT Google Assistant and Adafruit IO are working perfectly as a team and using the these IoT platforms we can make amazing monitoring and control systems. So anyways, you have got the idea of what exactly you are going to learn after watching this video. So without any further delay, let's get started. The components and tools used in this project can be purchased from Amazon. The components purchase links are given in the description. J1 is the DC female power jig and this is where we connect a 12 volt adopter, battery or a solar panel. Two 470 microfarad capacitors are connected at the input and output sides of the voltage regulator. 
The output of the voltage regulator is connected with a 5 volt pin of the ESP32 module and the ground of the power supply is connected with the ground of ESP32 module. These are 12 volt SPDD type relays and can't be directly controlled using the ESP32 module. So that's why we need a driver to control these relays. You can use a relay driver IC or you can use 2N222 NPN transistor and a 10 kilo ohm resistor. One pin of the relay coil is connected with the collector of the 2N222 NPN transistor while the other pin of the relay coil is connected with the 12 volts. The emitter of the transistor is connected with the ground while the base is connected with the 10 kilo ohm resistor. Now to control these relays you simply need to connect these 10 kilo ohm resistors with the ESP32 IO pins. In this project I am using the GPIO pins 13, 12, 14 and 27. I will be using the same pins in the programming. For now I am using only two relays. Relay number one I am going to use for controlling the electronic door lock and the relay number two I am going to use for controlling a light bulb. Here is my ESP32 development board. If you want to make the same development board, then you can watch my previous video. I will provide a link in the description. I connected the bulb and the electronic door lock as per the circuit diagram. Now let's start with the Adafruit I.O. This video is sponsored by Ultium. Ultium Designer is the world's most trusted PCB design system. Ultium Designer enables engineers to effortlessly connect with every facet of the electronics design process. Over 35 years of innovation and development focused on a truly unified design environment makes it the most widely used PCB design solution. With Ultium Designer, you can create PCB designs with an intuitive and powerful interface that connects you to every aspect of the electronics design process. Route it your way through any angle, tune for delay, push, slide and walk around faster than ever. Interact and collaborate with mechanical designers like never before in a photorealistic 3D design environment. If you want to get started with the Ultium Designer, you can click on the first link in the description. First, we are going to start with the Adafruit I.O. There is nothing complicated. Follow the same exact steps.
we will use this username and activate key in the programming anyways we are done with setting up the Adafruit IO now we will start working on the IFTTT Google Assistant So all my four applets are ready and now let's take a look at the programming. Before you start the programming, first of all make sure you install the Adafruit MQTT library. For this click on the sketch menu, go to the include library and then click on the manage libraries. Search for the Adafruit MQTT library and install the latest version. It's just a simple program. This is the Adafruit IO username. This is the Adafruit I.O. key.
So that's all for now. Open the door. Door is opened. Close the door. Door is closed. Turn on the light. The light is turned on. Turn off the light. Light is turned off. Support me on Patreon for more videos. I hope you like today's episode. Like and share this video with your friends. See you in next episode. And thanks for watching. Turn on the light. The light is turned on. Open the door. Door is opened. Close the door. Door is closed. Turn off the light. Light is turned off.